circling back to what we talked about, I want everyone to answer. Yeah. Do y'all think that nudity always equals sexual? No. Uh, let's go with the girls. Start with you. It's not supposed to, but yeah. 2024, yeah. And you? I was going to say no until she just said that. But yeah, nowadays everybody um, views everything very sexually, but it, yeah, not supposed to. Let me fix your mic. Oh, thank you. Yeah, because I'm trying to adjust it. Here you go. Um, I was going to say no, but yeah, in this day and age, everyone does view everything sexually um, when it shouldn't be. And I also feel like some movies and stuff, like they just do a lot of this weird shit. I mean, for things with kids, like why they got that on for. True. I can read what no, you're saying, but I just that. mean like, okay, like more like simpler. Like every time that somebody's basically like naked, is that always a sexual intention? intention? No. Like that other people can see it and blah, blah, blah. Is it always. She means it like in general, like nakedness in general. If, is na- that if sexual? somebody's naked in front of you, is it always. Oh, is it, yeah. No. Is it always. Sexual? No. No, no. Nope. Okay. Wait, but well, why was... The, hold on. Because I'm not done to answer this question, is, so I don't know is, why they asked y'all first. Hold on. Is, it's okay. Is it, it sexual? Okay, if somebody's standing in front of me, am I... Like, are you asking if I'm like looking if at it sexually? Like, if somebody's naked in front of you, is it always sexual too? Or do you think that people's intentions of being naked are just always sexual? Yeah. And ladies, to answer... now, maybe. <laughs> and to help y'all answer questions, don't think subjectively, like, about how your, like, own little view. Think objectively, like, outside of you, what in other general. people experience. Mm-hmm. So, in general. Um, so, s- same answer, no? Yes, no. Got it. What about you? No. No. And you? No. You? No, that's... How it goes back to, like, art, you know? <laughs> your whole art analogy thing not cause I'm fully agreeing with her okay. and that's why I asked that let's go with you nah nah okay and you, what you and think clearly, it, I think it's not you think it's not what ease you can go first on this one uh, what was the question if, if is ease, nudity you, <laughs> always sexual I, is nudity yes I think so because when a man or a woman is getting naked it's there's always uh, a sexual intent behind it. You know what I'm saying? So when you go or to the t- doctor, it's sexual? <coughs> Damn. Like, that was good. <laughs> um, good no, because you're getting, no, because you're getting checked for health for health reasons. Exactly. So, so you're not, naked, so, though. Exactly. So if they got to look at your Okay, wiener, but okay, like, but like, if you're standing in front of me naked, I'm not a f-ing doctor. <laughs> no, but I'm just saying that <laughs> is, is nudity always sexual though? But I'm just saying that people could look at your body naked for different reasons. Okay, but if you're in a hospital, that's attention. different. They they yeah, have but to. I'm just saying that because. But in general, you're naked. You gotta, you gotta, in general, you're naked, so it's nudity. So speaking from that, in a, in a hospital people. setting, no, you're not. You know exactly. what I'm saying? No, no you're not. People, but, but outside of a hospital setting, yes, it's considered sexual. Like so, you go to a museum, you'd be like. Oh, yeah, like, you be like that. He's not talking about himself. He's oh, okay. speaking in general. In, in general, um, like if somebody's <laughs> naked outside of a medical facility, it's considered considered well, sexual. So also, too, I want. Do you think that like so then since you think that nudity is always sexual, do you think that like breastfeeding in public is wrong and like that's also sexual and wrong? That's oh, good. Going. That's good. So I do like I think I answer in, last. So so do I think breastfeeding in public is sexual? Or wrong. Or wrong. Um, I do not because for one, it's that's that's how you, that's how you gotta feed the baby. Uh, exactly. Breastfeeding has been around f- for decades. You know, it's that's actually well. It, the only reason why it's not considered normal because everybody's a perv in twenty twenty four. Yeah. <laughs> so you know what I'm saying? So like something like breastfeeding should shouldn't be looked at as sexual, especially when it comes to feeding a baby because the baby's not looking at it as sexual. The baby's just hungry with some food. But if you ask a grown man that, he might think it's sexual because he's a homeball. You <laughs> but know what I'm still, saying? it's not a sexual thing though. No, breastfeeding is not a sexual exactly. thing. Exactly. It's not a sexual exactly. thing. But a, a random person Outside of the medical field, out naked, that's sexual. Like, why are you, like, why are you naked? Like, why yeah. do you want me to see your private parts so bad? <laughs> do you right. want me to get turned on? But we just thought of and two uh, very great examples that happen multiple times every single day where nudity is a very real thing that's not sexual, though. So I just think that nudity doesn't always have sexual intent. Yeah, well, I'm about to kill your dreams because yeah. you're wrong. No, so, well, you're a guy. You got to think about anatomy, I'm right? Y'all are just even girls. Why would you be naked outside, though? No, but I mean, like, y'all are ready to have two and, I, and if it's me and him at a sleepover and okay and I have to get Keep changed going. right quick 
Like, and I'm naked in front of him. Like, are you really gonna like really be like? Why are you getting so naked fast? in front of me? No, no. <laughs> I just like why are you having like, a sleep? No, like, <laughs> like, 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 I think it's I think it's objective. I think it's objectively. It's objectively, it's objectively. Yes, exactly. It's like y'all think about it too deep. Like, yeah, y'all are taking it too Changing in front serious. of your friends is not sexual. Like being naked really is not a sexual thing. True. Unless it's your own really like well obviously right, unless you're, unless you're taking it the person's intention is but people can be yeah well people are gonna sexualize everything but it's not about that's good living in La La Land but that's not. Not reality. So how about so, the locker room? Too? Listen, <laughs> but every I also, time I real quick, that part's time out. Everyone, yeah. be quiet, real quick. Okay. When I'm speaking, every time I speak, you I'm cut sorry. me off. I'm so we gotta, sorry. Now nah, we gonna really need you to listen and pay I know. attention. Can okay. I, like, I don't. We said it before. Cut me off. Though. It's like, it's, it. are you triggered? When I say, it, did y'all hear it? I tried to speak twice to answer her question, and immediately she cut me off. Calm I'm down, sorry. baby girl. It's okay. You know what I mean? Just like you'll be okay. It's all right. <laughs> so. uh to shut down your dreams, you're 100 percent wrong. All of you ladies are wrong. Ease, you're wrong too. I'll explain Damn. why everyone is wrong. So, uh, what's the first thing Adam and Eve um, uh, felt or noticed when they bit the apple? They noticed that they were naked, naked. right? So, when it's it's the intent. And it gets even more deeper than the intent. It's the nature of human beings, right? So we can say due to the circumstances or if it's at a doctor's office or if it's at a, what, you said a pajama party or something like that. Yeah, breastfeeding. Yeah. Breastfeeding and all of these friend, things. Like, all of that is fine and dandy, right? At the end of the day, this person may not be sexual aroused by it, but another person may be, meaning that we all have it in us to be sexually aroused, right? We all have it in us to do evils. We are all within sin. We all are capable of sin, right? Doing bad things. So with that being said, if all nudity is sexualizing, all nudity is sexualizing, you get it? It wouldn't been it wouldn't have been that case in the one of the oldest books if Adam and Eve once they bit the apple why did they they didn't notice like oh Dane I bit the apple well that tastes good they didn't notice their taste buds they didn't notice anything they was like oh I bit that apple oh wow well, like uh, uh I'm hungry I, maybe I want some more meat all of these things they didn't notice the first thing they noticed was <sighs> naked what the heck why am I naked Dane you looking kind of good Eve <laughs> Adam you looking good too <laughs> so. Yeah, it is sexualizing. Booyah. Don DeMarco. No. Can I have a question? They were already naked, though. They was already naked, though. In the garden, though. They was already naked. It's sexualizing. It was already naked. Until the nature. Until doubt entered. It's in human's nature to sexualize. Yeah, I feel like if you're really just... Yeah. If you... Okay, but back to like the case of like a mother breastfeeding her child. If you sexualize that, then you're disgusting. And Absolutely. that's literally your own issues and your own problems. And who are you to say God someone is... Say who, in the who, Bible who are you to say that, that that's disgusting, no, though? No, because if you're sexualizing a baby... No, you got it's a baby. That's disgusting. A mother. No, I just titties. said. I just said. If, if, if it's a baby involved. <laughs> oh it's literally a child. <laughs> it's on natural. The Think about tribal times. Think about tribal times. How we they live. People still tribal nowadays. But at the end of the day. No. Okay, there's still tribes it. out there. Living. Let's no. just use what you said. No. Time out, time out. Let Let's use your logic real quick. You, Let's just use your no. logic real quick. No. You just said that a, a mom breastfeeding is not sexualizing. Its nature is natural. So when you have sex, do guys suck on your titties? Me, what? yeah, because no. he's guys in the man. Your titties, God is man and woman. So if guys suck on I your cannot. titties and your titties is out, obviously <laughs> men can see. Your titties out. So obviously he will think either consciously or shit. subconsciously, dang them some nice titties or dang them titties lopsided. It's gonna be sexualized <laughs> oh regardless. I get, I get your point of view. You get I, the like, point. I get yeah. the point. I get their point and I get your point. Because it can mean either context. Though. I get I get both. It, it, My point hit to the root. No. But, it hits to the but root. At the, end of the, point 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 at the end of the day, <laughs> it, you may view it as, oh, it's just something basic like that, but another person will walk in and be like, damn, I have a boner now. Like, it just, it, one it's person will be like, oh, that's just that, a nurse walking in, blah, 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 and they're changing somebody, and it's like, okay, this is my job. I'm not turned on by this. But another person will walk in, and for whatever sick reason, they're turned on. So that's sexual to them. But and that's it, their own people sick be getting turned on. That's their own 50 50 balance though. Issue. You guys are both right. No, at the end of the day, this Thank is an argument. It is. This is an argument about. This is an argument. It isn't. This is an argument about nurture versus 
uh, uh, nature. So nurture versus nature. She's saying things that we've been kind of people been nurtured in to accept, right? What? I'm speaking about nature. It is in a man's nature to sexualize women. It is in a man's nature to view women as sexual. In it's your, in your nature, in your the woman's right. nature, okay. to There's, view things. Again, what, real quick, real quick. Saying is it I got it real quick. I'm not talking about, listen, this is a nature versus nurture argument, right? So all I'm saying that what she's saying, yeah, someone can be nurtured into thinking by society and social norms and be like, oh, it's just a woman's breastfeeding, you know, you know, it's socially acceptable now. Nature always wins. If the dude is horny enough, he ain't get cheeks in a while. That uh, dumb titties gonna be like, even being breastfed, gonna be like, damn, them some nice titties. You, you get what I'm saying? So nurture, nice. I mean, nature always wins. That's the root cause of it. I'm gonna add to that too. Um, there are a lot of women also that'll walk in and they'll see that and think it's completely disgusting right away. And I don't, I don't know why. And I agree that's it's mother baby, you know. But yeah. at the same time, um, we're programmed to be like naked isn't okay. So it's like, again, there's two point of views here and they're both right and they're both wrong. No, well, no, it nature tells to, you that it's wrong. No, but it comes down to context. <laughs> no, she's really though. spinning though because it it's comes really down about to context. context. It comes down to context. We already went through the context, baby girl. The context is nurture versus nature. People can be socially constructed to have a belief to accept something, right? But your nature from the two, first two people on this planet Earth, Adam and Eve, they even knew, oh, our nature is to cover up because we're naked, right? Why did they cover up? They weren't cold or anything. They was like, wait, wait, this is my parts, my body parts. This shouldn't be shown. This is something that's sacred. This shouldn't be shown out to the to the public let me cover up so yeah man anyways let's get any anyone else on this topic or get to the super chats or no no because the bible okay, said that don't mean it's right she said right. super chats right. i'm gonna just say that just because the, the bible said that don't mean it's right just, you know, <laughs> yeah you're saying oh that they're it's, not cold maybe they was cold i don't know I mean, i'm just saying i'm, I'm just right. literally going they back no in back. history read it. like something that's <laughs> thousands of years old the bible's history you gotta read it though you gotta know how to read it though but the bible also says what book do you know that's older no you can name one I know other books that's older than the Bible, but can you name one? You know, wisdom is associated to women, not men, right? You knew that? Y'all yeah, ain't showing it today. Wait, time out. <laughs> well, y'all oh, think y'all know something. Y'all don't think y'all know something. I'm just yeah. saying. Yeah. Because yeah, they I both came... start with a W? What's your no. logic to this? Yeah. Do you, you obviously don't read the Bible because wisdom is associated to a female in the book of Proverbs. How? He says she, it, he associates, God associates wisdom to a woman. So you obviously don't read okay, the Bible. Okay, how? I just found out. Because Proverbs is one of the biggest books. Proverbs and What's Psalms. What's the verse? Then the Old Testament and New Testament. The verse, Proverbs 3 and 5. Proverbs, what the whole. What does it pro say? Proverbs 3 and 5 is probably something about trust in the What's Lord with all on? your heart and lean on to your, not un your own understanding. Probably something like that. Oh, okay. Start, it's the beginning of Proverbs. It's verse immediately... Three, verse, verse 3, chapter like chapter uh, 5? Like, what cha is it? Uh, chapter 3, verse 5. Something like that. That's a very popular okay, one. Okay, and it talks about a, a woman being wise? Well, just the begin. Like, if you go to Proverbs 1, 2, it's probably going to already be talking about wo wisdom woman. being a woman. W yeah. Okay, no. A woman being wise or, no. or wisdom is, is woman. a woman. Yes. Oh, wisdom that's what you cries think? in the streets and who hears her? Yeah. Oh, wisdom cries, cries in the, the street. Oh, you interpreted that. Oh. <laughs> no, he says it's a woman. This read is the, funny. Read it. No, uh, baby okay. girl. All women Where is barely reaching. The in the, in the chat. I know they're blowing yeah, it up, bro. Um, speaking, baby girl. I'm sorry. Which, I mean, women is barely mentioned in the Bible. Ooh, Most of the stories are about men. <laughs> he uh, King it. Solomon. All of these guys are mm. was wise men. God even said, you they know, were astrologers you too. Want, when sorry. I'm speaking, I'm so sorry. Like, when you I were speaking, if I'm this funny. happens again, I'm gonna have to let you go. That's it's, okay. I might have to go. You, I get mean, you may have to go. And I love all of y'all though, for real, I really do. But I might have to because I'm uncontrollable when it comes to God. I okay, are you out? Yes. Okay, let's get you up out of here. All right, let's go. So I don't want to do that. Yeah, let's go. But Bye. I love all of y'all, though. Cool. Keep this it on camera, uh, uh, one, and fun. then you can walk around. The basket soon. is right there on the chair yeah. to the left. With oh, the two. Yeah, there. keep it on, too. Yeah, cool. Can I add to that? Yeah, uh, you bit? get you up out of here. Uh, let her, he's going to walk her out real quick because he's not switching the camera real quick. And then he's going to come back, and then you can add. So just keep your thought. Can I switch over? Oh, yeah, I'll have you switch. Actually, you can go now. Yeah. It's all about self-control. Yeah. Everybody's um, different. Yeah, that chick, it was, I mean annoying she was like a kid like yo you kid <laughs> like it was crazy i was like waiting like wait 
I'm going to speak. And then she starts talking. When I speak, it was like literally everything that I said triggered her. And she was talking nonsense. The Bible doesn't talk about woman wisdom yeah, I, I being a woman. It. It didn't yeah, she, she was lying. Like, when she talked, I was about to rip her to shreds. That's why she really wanted to go. Because I was picking at everything she was saying in the Bible. Like, yo, she want to have these biblical discussions. She'll get ripped. But, hey, chat, we do it live. It is what it is. We had to kick that annoying chick off. She kept interrupting which is very disrespectful you can tell she wasn't raised without any father at all uh not to say that other girls wasn't but y'all are acting you know very good and respectful right. today but sometimes some chicks is just yeah it'd be wild i didn't man. even know it was gonna be her but hey yeah now i had a feeling right <laughs> off the first 10 minutes so well, I, did, like, I did come late so i don't know no, no, i'm talking about 10 minutes is just doing a podcast oh, yeah, but yeah, 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 yeah. i'm like what's going on why she keep uh Can I add to that, though? just at the beginning of the bible because i've been reading the bible um, and I haven't gotten far in it, but I just want to say if women like had all the wisdom, I mean, why would Eve eat the apple? And then she, Give it a button. Give she it a fed button. it to her, to Adam too. So yeah, give me some, give me some, give me some. Yeah, <laughs> she. I was about go. to get all up in it too, but she she was there out. She ran. Like it was just crazy, bro. Like, and it's yeah, not to say that women don't have wisdom. Yeah, they yeah, are. I do. With, any all human beings are capable of good things, men and women. It's not to say that, but she was just talking nonsense. Like women are barely mentioned in the Bible. It's like a few women's names in the Bible, and they barely they don't even have a main story even focused on them. Maybe like That's two true. of them, but the stories are real short. Everyone else is it's men, and it's about wise men. So she's talking nonsense. But anyway, 